This is a TMM 5000 high speed universal programmer, and it can program the uh, ENC KB9020 chip as well. And in this video, I'm going to compare the speed between the Unique NT and the TMM 5000 high speed programmer. First, in software, you need to select the uh, KB922 and click. This is the, the connection and uh, it connects on this JTAG port and also it needs an external power supply. So let's power this on and have 3.3 volt. So it's ready. So let's first do a read comparison. So read. It's much faster than the CH341. Uh, so it's read is done and the data looks correct. So let's do uh, erase. Uh, this erase speed is a bit slower, but it's doing the sector erase other than the uh, chips erase. So it can understand why it's slow. So now if you read again, uh, it will be empty. So if you read everything is empty, uh, let's load. So 1922. And it's there, that's program. So program is done and we can do a verify So it's done. Now let's switch to the Ulink NT. So this is how the Ulink NT connect to the KB1922. It's quite simple. And let's switch the software. So this is how the Unink NT connect to the uh, KB1920 and because it has 3.3 volt, they can direct go here. It's quite easy. Uh, if, the, if you program the KB1922 on the board, you may not need to co connect the 3.3 volt. So first let's detect and it's there. So let's do a read and it'll only take two seconds. So. Uh, let's do erase and this is how erase is done then we can read one more time it should be empty yeah so if we load the same file here which is 92 this program and it's done three seconds and let's verify it's done as well. So you can see the Unic NT is significantly fast as well compared to the TNN 5000 high speed programmer. Um, uh, if we would program the 1912, it will be similar result. It's just much faster.